Oke, okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We are from the third group of data analysis subject. Our member consists of Dina Fitri Anissa and then Anissa Tulfarida, Desi Ana, Resta Oktaviani, Tias Mulyono, Mutia Rinjani, and Ima Siti Fatimah. Oke, okay, this PowerPoint uh, will explain how to develop a title. For the first is place we take is um, second semester English Education Department of IIN Surakarta. Why does the researcher choose this place? Because in this semester, students get argumentative text lecture. Instrument that we use are uh, the first is questionnaire that done in second semester English Education Department IIN Surakarta, and then. Second is document that consists of formative text argumentative writing. For variable, we choose the student's habit in watching English movie and writing skill. Why? Because the researcher hope that film development has an impact in writing skill. So we can make a title because we use correlation to variables as our design in this research so that we develop our research that titled a correlation between students habit watching English movie and writing skill in argumentative of second semester English education department EIN Surakarta in the academic year 2017 and 2018 okay for population, this school has five classes, consists of 2A, consists of 28 students, and then 2B consists of 29 students, 2C consists of 32 students, 2D consists of uh, 27 students, and the last is 2E consists of 34 students. For the sample, the researchers take 2E as a sample because students in this class have a high interest in watching English movie. The researcher take 2E as a sample from the result of technique that is purposive sampling. We use this technique because students' habit in watching English movies in 2E class is the highest. From the title that we arrange, we collect the data by using two instruments. There are questionnaire that we share to the students and the writing score we get from lecturer's document. Okay, next we are going to explain how to analyze data in SPSS. In this video, we want to share how to analyze quantitative data in correlative design to variables. Our research title is a correlation between students' watching movie habit and their argumentative writing skill. Before analyzing the data, we have been conducted a pre-research in second semester of English Education Department students in State Islamic Institute of Surakarta. The instrument we use in this research are questionnaire and document. For the first step is save the data of questionnaire in Microsoft Excel format to make easier importing the data in SPSS program. Do the same way for the data of formative tests that we get from the lecture. If we have done these steps, open the SPSS program. Next, choose new data set and the blank document will appear. First, we analyze the questionnaire data by using SPSS. Click variable view button to give the name of the column. Give the name X1 for first questionnaire statement, X2 for second questionnaire statement, and so on. Click menu, file, choose import data, and click Excel. Browse the data of questionnaire that we have been saved before. Copy the questionnaire data and paste it in column X1 until X10. Place the pointer in a new column then click transform menu, click compute variable. Give the name of target variable with 
WMH or watching movie habit at X1 plus X2 plus X3 and so on then click OK the result of the WMH will appear the next step is make a new blank document by click menu file and choose new data fill WMH in the name column give the information in labels column that describes watching movie habits fill the second column name with AWS and fill argumentative writing skill in the second label column then import the data of student writing score by clicking a file menu import data and excel browse the student writing score that have been saved in excel format to analyze these two data click menu analyze then choose correlate and choose bivariate Add WMH and AWS into variable columns. Make sure you checklist correlation coefficient in person and checklist the test significance in two tailed, then click OK. The result of correlation will appear. To check whether the result is valid or not, Look for the significance number is less or more than 0 0.05. If the significance number less than 0 0.05, it means HO is accepted. It means watching movie habit doesn't correlate it with argumentative writing skill. If the significance number more than 0 0.05, it means that HO is rejected, or it means watching movie habit correlate with argumentative writing skill. The significance of the research is 0 0.006 or less than 0 0.05 and it means that the result of our research is watching movie habit is correlated with argumentative writing skill okay i think it's all from our group thank you so much and wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh